This is a olive. Oh, it's been around here maybe 25, 30 years. And we have a mica pot. And guess who is here visiting or who's going to be starring in this chapter? Yes, it's Dale. He should be here right now. He's out there looking for the rocks. Anyway, so that's what we're doing today, or Dale is doing today. He's taking this uh, olive and finishing it up like he typically does. So stay tuned. He's in here. He's going to put it together. Look at that. Perfect fit. Of course, he had to work at it, but hey. So he likes to pre-select everything versus me. I get halfway and then go look for rocks. Well, let's see how he does this. Hopefully most of you are understanding the difference in style, how we put things together. Because I would typically fill the whole thing with soil and then add the rock. But evidently he visualizes way ahead of time what he wants to do. I tend to wing it. So I just wait till everything is halfway done and then go look for the rocks. Versus Dale, he likes everything in place and then he puts it together in one shot. Hmm. Okay, now it's starting to come together. We gotta take a lunch break here, so we'll get back to you after we have lunch. Can't work on bonsai on an empty stomach. So he's starting to put the finishing touches on the tree itself. Of course, the most exciting part when he gets down to finishing up the, the soil level. Okay, he's out there looking for moss, and he was explaining to me his vision, uh, I guess in the Orient. I know from uh, my travels and some of the TV programs, they have these natural occurring um, springs where there's water that uh, you can drink. And so he is thinking that this is uh, in a deep forest with a nice big tree. And then the water, well, it's stylized, but it's coming from a natural spring into this water basin. That's the way he was explained to me. So anyway, uh, he's almost at that finish, so when he comes back and finishes this up, we'll go ahead and wrap it up. So anyway, 
Dale does have an interesting way of doing this. Like I said, it's not the same process that I tend to go through, but I think that's why I enjoy working with him. It's not like I'm teaching him, but he's teaching me and we're kind of learning from each other. And I think that's uh, the whole basis of a bonsai or any art form is have your own unique style. Okay, this is the front, the finish. Let's take a really close look. It's looking really good. To turn this slowly so we can see all sides. Looks good on this side too. Well, Dale did add one more rock. Uh, sometime you just can't predict everything from the uh, get-go. But anyway, this is what he had envisioned. We talked about uh, out in the mountains with the, the spring and the natural occurring water. So this is his interpretation of that. So this is Hero saying goodbye, and Dale don't want to be talking, so he won't say anything yet. But I got a dual mic system, so one of these days I'll make him talk to you guys. See you again real soon. Goodbye.